Remember to subscribe and hit the bell icon to never miss an update from my mums. Baby bath benefit and care. Bathing a baby is one of the most important aspects of baby care. A baby's skin is very sensitive and requires very gentle handling. Bath time is not only essential for maintaining good hygiene, but it has several benefits for the baby's health and development. Today, I, Dr. Anita Chaudhary, will tell you the benefits of baby bath and proper care that should be taken while bathing your little baby. Benefits of baby bath. It helps maintain hygiene. One of the most obvious benefits of a baby bath is maintaining good hygiene. Babies tend to get dirty quickly as they're always exploring their surroundings. Bathing helps to remove dirt and bacteria from the skin, preventing infections and keeping them healthy. It promotes relaxation too. Bathing is a calming activity that can help babies relax and sleep better. Warm water can soothe a baby's muscles and ease any discomfort they may be feeling. Adding gentle bubbles or lavender essential oils to the bath water can also help to relax the baby. It also improves the baby's sleep. Bathing a baby before bedtime can promote better sleep. The warm water and gentle massage can help to calm the baby and prepare them for sleep. Bath time can also become a part of a bedtime routine which signals to the baby that it's time to sleep. But traditionally in India, we do give a morning bath and I have personally noticed the child sleeps really nicely after a bath. Bathing also enhances cognitive development. Bath time is an excellent opportunity to stimulate the baby's cognitive development. Talking to the baby, singing song and playing with bath toys can all help to promote their cognitive development. The baby can also learn about cause and effect by splashing and playing with the water. And I've seen children actually love splashing water, so give them little time, but always supervise. It strengthens the bond between the baby and the mom too. While bathing a baby can be a bonding experience between the baby and you, how it works, the close physical contact during bath time can help to strengthen the bond between both of you because that is the time when the baby has total faith and is so relaxed. It is an excellent opportunity for you to talk, sing and play with the baby, promoting communication and social skills. Simple things like baby splash the water, see the water, you know, and you can just pour the water on the baby's head, the baby will actually enjoy. Proper care for baby bath is very important choosing the right time. Bath time should be scheduled at a time when the baby is alert and not too hungry or sleepy. Bathing a baby after a feed can cause discomfort due to the pressure on the baby's tummy. Likewise, bathing a sleeping baby can be challenging and there is a risk of the baby slipping under the water. Now preparing the bath area. The bath area should be prepared before bringing the baby to the bath. The bath water should be at the right temperature, neither too hot nor too cold. A baby bath seat or a non-slip mat should be placed in the bathtub to prevent the baby from slipping. And you should also have all the necessary items such as soap, shampoo, towels and a change of clothes within reach. As an Indian mother, what I did to give a bath to my babies, I would actually hold them Little infants, when they were a few days old, I would actually hold them upside down and take water and in the basin, I would stand and give them a bath. So that way I was very sure the water was not entering the eyes or the nose and then just wrap them around and mop them dry. Another technique that we follow in India is you can sit down and you can place your baby on your feet and then give the baby a bath. It is very important to test the water temperature. The water temperature should be checked by placing the hand or it shouldn't be more than 36-37 degrees because that is the temperature of your baby's body. 
A bath thermometer can also be used to check the water temperature or you can just put your wrist or elbow in the water to check the temperature. But without testing, never put your baby in any kind of water. Now handling the baby. The baby should be handled gently and with care during bath time. The mom should support the baby's head and neck while placing them in the bath. The baby should be kept close to the mom and one hand should always be on the baby to prevent them from slipping underwater. Be careful and avoid getting water in the baby's eyes, ears or nose. If it happens, just clean it. Simple techniques. Now the most important thing, what products to use? Baby products such as soap and shampoo should be gentle and free from harsh chemicals that can irritate the baby's skin. Preferably use herbal products. Please avoid using too much products as they can cause dryness and irritation. Indian ways to massage the baby, let them play for a while and then give a bath. You can use homemade paste of besan that is gram flour and malai that is cream. Just mix it, apply it on the baby's body, leave it for some time and then give baby a bath with warm water and pat it dry with a soft towel. And this is a simple thing that you will enjoy doing it every day because baby also loves a bath. So thank you and Namaste.